love that. I love that. And in fact, one of my most favorite things, and I know Mirren has been saying it a lot, is as soon as they say something like no or negative, I always respond in, oh, that's interesting. Why is that? So they might say, oh, no, we don't do corporate lets. Oh, that's interesting. Why is that? Oh, no, we've had terrible issues with corporate lets. Oh, that's interesting. Why is that? And quite often, you know, it may be that you get down to the, the level that they just, you know, they're a national brand and they just don't do corporate lets and that's perfectly fine. But more often than not, you if you're going to the smaller ones, they may have had an incident with a corporate let. But I know one of the ones that I had, it was actually a charity and they had genuinely trashed the place. And once they found out that actually I was running something that's like a hotel and it has to be in hotel quality condition and that I have ring cameras and that I take my own personal deposits and that I do all of these checks, they're a bit like, oh, well, that is quite interesting. So it's kind of, yeah, I, I love that. So if anyone uh, takes something away from today, that's a really great one. I always say, oh, that's interesting. Why is that? Um, and I, I think that can can really help along the way. So we've kind of spoken about, you know, your, your journey and coming along here. But one thing that I'm always really interested in finding out in the way people learn as well. <clears throat> so one of the things that we do is obviously you guys, we have one to ones, one on ones. Um, you have access to me on, on on WhatsApp. But then what we also do, don't we, is I have a, a, a subscription group and we all meet two to four times a month and there's a, there's a group of us um, and we're able to talk through what we're doing, how that's, how that's happening. And I know you both are real fans of, of both sides of it. So I'd, I'd love to kind of hear from you what it is that you get from kind of the individual, but also on the um, on the on the group side. So, Mirren, can I throw that question at you? Yeah, sure. <clears throat> uh, so, the first thing that springs to mind is you get to hear about what other people are doing. Um, you know, whether that's a different strategy or um, along a, a different. You know, they they they're ahead of you. For example, you know they they. They've already got two rent to rent essays, you know, and you get to learn quite a lot. Um, and there are a lot of questions, a lot of tips that you share uh, that are, are helpful. You know, they'll help me eventually once I do get the uh, essay. So, yeah, I find I find them really useful. Um, just finding out what people are up to, I guess. You know. Fantastic. I love that. And uh, Omar, how about yourself? Yeah, similar actually. I think it's it's when you're in a group as well. Like it's th those different questions from the same. It's, it's 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 amazing how you look at the same issue, but five five different people might have five different questions. So I think having groups like this, um, and also as Mirren said, so we are at different stages of our journey. Uh, it's just that because we started at different times. <laughs> um, so when you when you when you share an issue, or when you read somebody else's an, uh, issue that they're facing. It's just a different perspectives. Uh, and of course, I mean, having somebody like Emma as well, then you can say, well, yeah, I've come across this. And then somebody might look at it differently. Um, I think one-to-ones, um, you get, I, I like it uh, a lot because you really get to choose a very bespoke, something which is really related to your situation. Um, so really focus on what you're doing and then pick that as a subject and then, and then really take a deep dive. Uh, and I think depending on the issue and and, and the, the the situation you face, both of them could be useful. I think, in, in their own ways. Yeah, I, I love that. And for, for me, um, you know, I I did a lot of training through masterminding. And if anyone follows um, Think and Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill, that's a huge element of masterminding. And and you do see that. I mean, I'm sure even with your you know business partner or even with your friends you can sit down can't you and you've been sort of thinking about something and when you start sharing it and that everyone else starts talking about it it's not double it's literally like multiplied so much the kind of uh, the 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 way you can sort of go forward so I, I love the whole kind of masterminding and also um, each kind of individual will have an issue which crops up um, and exactly as you've said, uh, I'm not just the only one who has knowledge. We've all got 
um, what I call just, you know, life experience. And that can really help us. And seeing, for instance, how Omar um, dealt with a, you know, a challenging client and seeing how Mirren dealt with, you know, the very first letting agent that he spoke to, absolutely um pulling the the rug from under him enables other people to go okay that's really interesting i wonder how i would react in that way um and it's just a a really kind of lovely way of of sort of looking at it and i i do think there's i mean i still do masterminding i mastermind as a business um i mastermind with other you know people who also do mentoring i i mastermind with obviously with property people um, I absolutely love it. And every time I come away, there's two big things. One, I'm sat all day looking at my business and I'm not in my business. So if nothing else, even when I have bus uh, even when I have meetings and things like that, I make sure that that is a massive priority and I never miss them. I'm one of the only people that never miss them because I see it as being really, really important. And then secondly, the kind of things that we've we've touched on here is seeing what other people do. I love to be, you know, the <laughs> the least experienced or the least successful person in the room because guess what? They really push you and grow you. So it's, uh, yeah, an incredible thing to do. Well, look, guys, this has been so, so interesting. I really love and I hope this has helped other people because I know for me, I actually um, followed somebody really closely who was just ahead of me when I very first started. And it gave me such inspiration knowing those things like, you know, Mirren has said where I'd had no's and uh, where this had gone wrong and that had gone wrong. And I didn't really know, you know, which sofa to use. Um, all of these things were just so great to have somebody who is, you know, just that little bit ahead of you. So, OK, so I will have a bit of a closing statement from you guys. Um, yeah a bit of a, a kind of a confirmation of of where you want to go in the next month or so uh, i know we're coming to the end of this first quarter so where where would you like to see yourself and then you can put it out to the universe and uh, and we'll be able to come back and uh, <laughs> see see how we're doing along the way so uh Mira, do you want to kick off with that uh I, I think you already know it's uh perhaps securing my first or second uh rent rent essay I love it. I love it. Uh, Omar, how about yeah, absolutely. Yes. Uh, yes. So we are looking to increase our portfolio as well. Um, we're looking at another two to be added as soon as possible. Um, and that's, yeah, that, that, that's something that I'm looking forward to uh, being busy with. Brilliant. Well, look, guys, I really, really appreciate um, you sharing your time here today with us. Um, I wish you all the all the you know success in the world. And um, I'm yeah very honoured that I'm here to help you along the way as well. So, yeah, absolutely. So, um, yeah, I will. I believe be back next week. I know we're in half term, but I'm I missed a couple because of kids stuff. Um, so I think I am doing this again next week. Um, so I look forward to seeing you all then. And again, thank you so much, Omar and Miran. Take care. Thank you, Omar. Thank you so much, Emma. I love that. I love that. And in fact, one of my most favorite things, and I know Miran has been saying it a lot, is as soon as they say something like no or negative. I always respond in, oh, that's interesting. Why is that? So they might say, oh, no, we don't do corporate lets. Oh, that's interesting. Why is that? Oh, no, we've had terrible issues with corporate lets. Oh, that's interesting. Why is that? And quite often, you know, it may be that you get down to the, the level that they just, you know, they're a national brand and they just don't do corporate lets and that's perfectly fine. But more often than not, you if you're going to the smaller ones, they may have had an incident with a corporate let. But I know one of the ones that I had, it was actually a charity and they had genuinely trashed the place. And once they found out that actually I was running something that's like a hotel and it has to be in hotel quality condition and that I have ring cameras and that I take my own personal deposits and that I do all of these checks, they're a bit like, oh, well, that is quite interesting. So it's kind of, yeah, I, I love that. So if anyone uh, takes something away from today, that's a really great one. I always say, oh, that's interesting. Why is that? Um, and I, I think that can can really help along the way.